In order to solve this quadratic equation, we need to put it in the form ax squared plus bx plus c equals zero. That means first I'm going to multiply out the left side to get x squared minus 6x equals 16. Then I'm going to need to bring the 16 over to get x squared minus 6x minus 16 equals zero. Now I'm ready to factor this so that I can set each factor equal to zero. I know the first terms will be x. Because of the minus, I know that the terms will be opposites. And so I might try 8 and 2, or 2 and 8. Some other possibilities are 4 and 4, or 16 and 1. But let's try these and see what happens. Let's try plus 8 and minus 2. It gives me a positive 8x on the inside and a negative 2x on the outside. That's a positive 6x when I add them. That tells me I should change the signs because I want a negative 6x. So I can see now with a negative 8x on the inside and a positive 2x on the outside, that gives me the negative 6x I was looking for. So then I'm solving x minus 8 equals 0 and x plus 2 equals 0. Adding 8 to both sides, I get x equals 8. Subtracting 2 from both sides, I get x equals negative 2. So 8 and negative 2 are the two solutions to this quadratic equation.